In this video, we'll be taking a look at answering the question, what is Maya? What can you do with it? What's it good for? Made by Autodesk, uh, Maya is a very powerful program that allows you to create geometry and objects to create art, to recreate objects, to design, to animate, to create any sort of thing that you feel you might need such as a full scene. The general workflow within Maya starts with creating models that create these shapes, manipulating objects that allow you to essentially sculpt, in some cases welding and cutting and trimming pieces to make objects that have an end result for the sort of work that you're looking for. For example, we're recreating a lamp and a little decorative box in this sort of scene by creating models that will give us the shape that we need for those objects. And once we're done adjusting these models and this geometry into the forms that we need, we'll be able to add some textures to them, some colors and some life to give the objects a sense of reality and substance. Once we have our assets or objects all created, at that point it becomes a matter of photography, in which case you want to visualize your scene as much as possible before going in and placing Maya lights to start rendering your scene and ending up with a result that has some depth of field, for example, that gives you a real sense of camera. And all of these things start with basic shapes called primitives that are then adjusted. For example, you can start shaping objects using some of their components, such as a vertice, as I've used here, to start making the objects that you need. And of course, animation in Maya is quite popular and it's a wonderful tool for being able to animate characters as well as objects or even effects such as steam coming off of a locomotive or even a little patch of flowers in a grassy field. All of these are very capable features within Maya and its interface. It's important to realize that Maya is a tool that is meant to get you to a place where you want to be artistically, creatively, and having idea of what these objects will be for you and how they will speak for you creatively is, of course, the first and probably hardest step to creating anything. And then getting familiar with the tool, how to move in 3D space, how to create objects and how to edit them, how to create lighting and cameras to effectively get a good output is what Maya is all about. And with time and experience, you'll be able to build your own objects and light them and give them a sense of life and animation. In this video, we took a look at answering the question, what is Maya? What sorts of things is it useful for? And how is it going to be useful for me?